Hello, in this video we connect our GPS to our computer and we transfer the incoming data from the GPS to our program called Youth Center. And Youth Center is a free program you can download. I will put a download link in the description of this video. One warning, uh, Youth Center is only available for Windows. So if you're on a Mac, you cannot run this program. And this is the type of uh, GPS I'm using. To connect the GPS to the computer, I am using this USB to a serial converter. And because it was the first time I am using this converter, I had to install a driver. And I found a driver on this website. I will put a link of this website in the description of the video. And this is how I connect the GPS on the converter. The 5 volts. The receiver from the GPS is going on the transmitter from the converter. And the uh, transmitter from the GPS is going to the receiver and the ground. If you do not have a converter like this one, you can use an Arduino as well. And then you use the transmitting and receiving pins. You can download the Youth Center software on this website. I will put a link in the description. Just uh, click download and install it. So this is the USB converter inside my computer and you see the incoming receiving light is blinking. And this is my GPS connected to the antenna. And you see there is a light blinking here as well and that means that the GPS has a fixed position. So if you open Youth Center for the first time, you enter this screen. And in my case, I have to set over here the COM on 9. So make it COM 9. And you directly see that there are satellites on the map. And over here, you can set the bout rate. In my case, it's 9600. Uh, but you have to find your own settings for your own personal computer. And inside the uh, Youth Center software, you see the all the incoming values from the GPS. And probably it's hard to see on the video, but this is the map of the world. This is Greenland, Canada, Alaska, United States, Russia, and Europe. And I live here in the Netherlands. And uh, it's funny because you see that my GPS inside my room is uh, talking with a GPS here by the Hudson Bay or this one in above Cuba or this in Brazil green means it has a good signal and this one uh, near Vancouver is red so it's not a good signal coming in but it's 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 fun to see a visualization of all the incoming uh, GPS signals. You also can open a screen to see the incoming data inside a text file. And then the receiving information look like this. If you have a GPS uh, similar to this one with a flight control memory, then you can upload waypoints to the to this module and I don't play around with uh, drones and airplanes but a website which is uh, dedicated to this is this website so you can plan your flight inside uh, Google Maps and upload the waypoints to the module and uh, the GPS will take over the control of the of your drone anyway I have no time to play around with aircrafts but uh, this is a very nice uh, website and it uh, l with lots of information about uh, GPS and how to use the module to control your craft. Uh, this is the end of the video. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.